So call her dad up, maybe take him to lunch or maybe just, you know, a time when nobody's there or call her dad and say, hey, I wanted to, you know, I wanted to come by and, and talk to you. Your daughter expressed some concerns and, you know, I, or maybe if you're on good enough terms, you just go over and knock on the door and just say, hey, I wanted to come by and chat because, you know, your daughter said that you weren't OK with her going out and dating and I wanted to come over and talk and see what we could do, you know, because it seems like maybe you have some concerns or maybe I've done something to upset you. And it's like, I'm here. It's like, my, I really adore your daughter. We have a lot of fun together and I really want to keep seeing her. She wants to keep seeing me, but obviously you have some concerns. So I'm, I'm here to address them. And it's like, and plus, you know, it's like you and my dad have been, you know, good friends since high school and so I don't want to disappoint you. I don't want to, dis especially don't want to disappoint my dad. And it's like, what do I need to do? What do I need to do to give you a level of comfort? What are the rules? How, what, how do you expect me to treat your daughter? What do you expect me to do? Should I call you every time we're going to go out? It's like, do you want me to share my location with you? It's what would you like me to do? It's like, because I really adore her and I don't want to disappoint you. I especially don't want to disappoint my dad. Because we're all kind of family already and, you know, I want everybody to look good and I want you to be happy. I want you to feel safe and secure that you trust me and that you know that your daughter is in good hands. So it's like, and then just hear him out. Hear what he has to say. And he'll appreciate that. It'd be much better just to go over when you know he's home. Maybe you can ask your your girlfriend is like, hey, when is your dad home and that I can come by and talk to him?